Hello everybody. Well, I don't know about you, but if you follow predecessor, if you play the beta, you are probably very, very, very excited to hear this. Or you will be very excited to hear this. So, predecessor, Omega Studios closes 20 million series A. Now, for those of you who don't know, predecessor is basically a remake of the game Paragon which was released uh, for the PlayStation 4 and was ditched by um, Epic Games because they needed all their power to move towards developing Fortnite, which already showed some great, great success early on. So basically, they just ditched the project, releases the assets, and then some developers pick it up. It's not the only company who actually worked on a remake, but I tried uh, all of them, the other ones, and predecessor by far was the best one among all that I tried. Um, the thing is that uh, now, where they actually uh, funded, we can expect this game to be even much better uh, because they can now hire uh, developers and creative people and really make this game even better than before. So as you can see here, we're extremely proud to share that we have closed 20 million Series A run led by Evelyn Investment which exists in investor, blah, blah, blah. Uh, we've been working together with our community to really define what a MOBA looks like in today's day and age. Exactly. Uh, having close relationships with our community. Yep, yep, yep. Has allowed us to iterate fast and think uh, people are going to be extremely excited when they get their hands on the game in early access. Yeah, and of course, I play this and I just love what I've seen. And definitely, I know that it's going to be better and now even better. So this is amazing, amazing, amazing news. Now, you need to understand that in some situation, I kind of worried because again, when it's small developer, uh, you kind of worried whether, you know, how they will promote the game. And uh, again, the important thing is, especially for multiplayer to have a large fan base. And it's not, we're not talking just about uh, you know, the fan base of those who actually enjoy Paragon, but just inviting many, many more. So we have a very, very active community. So you can find games to play in different hours, different locations around the world. And we can have maybe esports around it, very important. So this all need funding. I also need, uh, I wanted to make sure that we have very high quality new heroes with amazing videos and promotion, like Epic Games did. And I really think it's important for this game to become an esport. Uh, and in my opinion, this is like, uh, the like kind of a next gen MOBA games and that's why I thought when it was first released uh, several years ago and this is the type of MOBA that I enjoy playing of course I played many other MOBA games but this is the one that really was very very immersive and really something that just couldn't stop playing so basically that's what it was just spreading the word about this game so you know about it wishlist this game i don't epic game store or on steam now i don't know when this funding now uh if it's actually going to delay the game so the developer took their time by the way they didn't rush the game which is very very important other ones which i try felt so rushed this is insane like they are competing with the other and just release really even in early access i think it was a disaster but that's my opinion uh, only predecessor was the one that feel more complete but it still needs work it still needs like you see that things are not completely there you see the great assets you know that epic games put out there uh but there's something against the ui and things just this it's not yet there yeah definitely more polish uh but i have no doubt now that with the finding they will get there so whether the game will now even get delayed, I don't care. As long as they deliver a great game, I don't want them to fail. I want this game to stay for a long time. So I don't mind them just taking their time, even if it take more months and I don't care. As long as they're going to deliver an amazing gameplay experience, the same that I experienced as Paragon and Predecessor is the one that I can assure you is... When I played it, it's already there. I really enjoy it and I felt like I'm playing Paragon, but it still needs work just to make sure that it's ready for eSport. Everything is there, you know, polished and it runs well, so it can really grow and become a very, very popular MOBA game. So this is it. If you're a MOBA fan or you play Paragon and you're a fan of Paragon, make sure to wishlist this one. If I have more news, I'm going to share it on my channel. So make sure to subscribe and give a like. See you soon. Cheers.